Okay, see you. Out. Hey! You in the A few moments later. Yo, hey, my guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we'll be revealing the new project car. As the thumbnail says, a lot of guys assume that I am clickbaiting. Uh, so I just like to clarify that quickly. Yes, I am kind of clickbaiting, but let me just explain. So basically, my cousin had a car before. Uh, the car was done up. Then we sold the car and bought a new project car. Okay, so yes, the car does not belong to me, but my cousin does live over the road and I will be working on the car as well as himself. So yes, it is kind of a project for both of us. We will be working on the car, but the car does not belong to me. The car literally lives over the road. So basically, uh, I wouldn't say I own the car, but yes, I will mainly be working on the car as well. So yes, it is a project for myself as well as himself. So I'm literally just going to walk over the road and reveal the car to you guys. So this is the new new project car reveal as the thumbnail says just gonna show you guys um, how the car looks as you can see the car already has rims on this is from um, his previous car there is a slight knock over here which we are going to sort out now, there is a few things that needs to be done on the car you guys quickly uh, this front bump over here has a crack which we will be sorting out as well and here's a few ideas that we do already have for the car a few mods that we do also have I'll show you the interior so what the interior looks like the seats has been done over nicely I'll just show you guys the engine bay as well like does need a bit of a clean so I'm just gonna give you guys a walk around on the car the car does also have a back box so that's gonna sound good as well So I just went to go fetch the car quickly and then I'm just going to go to a friend of mine's place uh, or workshop. He actually sells um, fiberglass parts. We may be going to get uh, a Mugen lip or some few ads to the car. Uh, I'll see you in a bit.
find the first problem uh, is a nut. It's kind of stripped. Let me show you quickly. See, it's round already. Uh, just focus quickly. As you can see, the nut is stripped. So, what I plan on doing is jacking the car up and then instead of breaking the bumper, I'm going to just attempt to remove um, this part of here and then we can maybe replace it with a new one because it does seem that it needs to be replaced anyway. So I'm just going to do that quickly. Before I take this, those drastic measures, I'm going to try to make it loose with some silicone spray. Let's see if it's going to work. I'll just let that sit. We have the bump off. Just need to show you guys the crack better. Here's uh, a massive crack, but it's going to look much better once we put the tie strap over here. And then basically, I'll just cube on it. I'll also maybe try to plastic uh, weld it, and then on the inside as well. Looks like So let me just explain to you guys uh, what I've done. I use the tape just to close the hole up over here. So I let the tie straps are in just to keep everything in place. The reason for putting up the tape over here, so when I do put the glue in on the other side, it does not come through. So I'd advise you guys to just put tape on. Um, across this way so that it keeps the hole closed, the crack closed and then just tape it up the whole crack so that the glue does not come right through A few inches later Okay guys, so this is a better look at uh, 
the Mugen lip. I think it came out good. We remove the number plate just to see if there's any damage behind it. We do plan on doing the bumper over. So bear in mind this is only temporary. It did come out good though. Doubt it will break anytime soon. Cars looking good. Okay, so next time we do plan on fitting a rear spoiler. We do plan on going with a Mugen rear spoiler. The whole theme of the car might just be Mugen. So stay tuned for that. Thank you guys for making it to the end of my vlog. Uh, just like to apologize again for the clickbait. Um, going forward, like I said guys, the car does not belong to me. However, I will mainly be working on the cars and, and you guys will be seeing the car a lot. Also, I'd just like to thank you guys that are subscribing and liking. I do see you guys subscribing and liking. I appreciate it so much. Please do mention in the comment section if you, what you guys like to see on this new project car as well as on my car as well. Um, also, just like to ask you guys to maybe follow me on Instagram as well. Because on Instagram, I do make a lot of statuses. Um, just giving you guys a a short description or a short status uh, you guys will be seeing in the future on the the vlog as well so please follow me on instagram it is at wong uh, underscore street to track as well as please do follow my cousin um he will be posting a few pictures of his car or you will mainly see pictures of his car on his instagram as well i'll just add his instagram in my description so please guys do like and subscribe and please comment. See you guys next time. Peace.